concept is here, he shakes, shakes, and he takes him down, really kind of a Muay Thai clinch, and he sinks under, catches a guillotine. Hey, Mike, can you demo that, you know, for the YouTube crowd here? Basically, once I get him on the ground, my hands are in a head clinch position. All I'm doing is keeping his hand, slide this one underneath the drop him And you get there, and you come in, and that's a really clean guillotine right there. And again, here at John's Annual Camp, we do a lot of skill training, and Mike is one of our skilled Shingitai coaches. He's from the Washington, D.C. area. What he's explaining is catch that, catch that tie, pop it free quickly, tear it off. So I can't snap now, it's easy, so I push him. Pull him. Right? And I got just a, it's like a kill team, but it doesn't rely on. If you're not concerned about which way you're pushing right now, I don't have to do the kill train, it's just here. Okay. So the hand, the hand, just comes under, and I grab my own core. Let's see this pressure here. Gotcha. It's all right here. So I'm not doing all this. Yeah. It's, I try to do it so the feet turn and spin away from the if I have just the head. So I go like this, and while you're shaking me, you're going to change level. That's the shake and bake. He pops, pops, does the takedown, kind of a Muay Thai clinch takedown. And he's finishing with a really sneaky, um, um, you know, overhead, uh, you know, guillotine choke. The shake and bake is basically, if he's really strong, right, if I pull down, he wants to go up. If I push, he wants to go in. Okay. So what I'm going to do is do a quick change of direction on his head. Mm -hmm. So I want to get good control here. He's a real strong guy, so I'm actually going to push him. In. Mm -hmm. And then he'll, he won't run it back, and then I'll pull him. And I want to get it tight for him. Right. Or I can use my body weight. And I go back and forth on my body weight, and I'm going to drop my weight. So back very quick. Nice spin to the takedown. And all the time you're, you're sucking them in even tighter, aren't you? Yes. Every time you're just, just getting them in tighter and tighter. I draw forward and a circle. And you, you really break the balance there. Usually their legs face away from each other. Mm-hmm. Okay, so that's uh, that's his concept of what he's called shake and bake. And bake is just get good control, keep gaining more control, tightening up, and as a good clean takedown. So there we have the shake and bake that Mike's training.